Hello everyone and welcome to another Forgotten Heralds tutorial. This is Holy Ruin and this is an update for an earlier video auto custom builder for Smite. No longer does it have its own tab. So you have to go ahead and go into Gods and Wards tab. Underneath Gods and Skins, you click on whichever god you need to update. We're just going to use Sir Ket for any purpose. Uh, item Builder is located underneath Purchase Locked Free Rotation uh, symbol. Click it, and you'll see it's already got the custom up, so it'll have all this emptiness right here. You can click through and go to Standard and Arena to get a better idea of what you should put in there. So we're going to go to Custom. We're going to click Starter. Death's Tool is fine. So you can build this however you want. This is going to be what's going to pop up whenever you press I to look at your store. Um, so. Now that I put death's toll up there, you can see the price is 800 in green. Directly underneath it, there's a box that you click that says build. Click that. Down at the bottom left, you'll see item build. And you'll see that death's toll just popped up down there. And that's essentially it. That's all you really need to do. So you build however you want and fill this out however you want. And you can keep looking at it and seeing where the offense, defense, and utility are going to be at level 20 and all the way down to level 1, which is pretty cool. So you'll have a better idea of what you're going to be able to do and how you should play or what have you. So you build it, make sure you have all six slots filled. Um, notice that when you go to active, put whatever, I'm just clicking whatever, you notice that you can't actually build that. So. There's a good reason for that, and that's because everybody had actives in their custom builds, and so when, when they'd go into a match, they'd automatically be dropped in, and they'd be going up against an Ares or a Hades or someone, and they didn't have an escape, and they were not able to use Aegis or Beads to get out of it. So they're no longer allowing you to have that in a custom build or consumables either, which is good too. So that way... You have a little more control over the match even though you're using a custom build. So when you're done, you click Save Custom. And then whenever you go back to Custom, there it is. Right there, saved exactly how you had it. Close out of that, and whenever you play, make sure that you have Auto Item Purchase clicked on the tab where you choose your god before the match. Otherwise, this isn't going to work. It's not going to work but you'll still be able to pull down the t custom tab and see your own custom ideas. So uh, thanks for watching, and thanks for the questions. Keep the questions coming. I'll be posting uh, build videos here shortly. Uh, keep up with me on Twitter uh, and Twitch, and thanks again for watching. Subscribe below.